Hey everybody, it's Alan, and I hope that you're doing well. Today is February 1st, and that is the birthday of one Mr. Mike Campbell. I know most people who would celebrate Mike's birthday would probably go to a song from the Tom Petty archives, but we're actually going to listen to a song from one of Mike's solo albums, and it's a song called Lightning Boogie. Lightning Boogie. Lightning Boogie, it double speed. Yeah, Lightning Boogie, it's all you need. Lightning Boogie, gonna knock you out. Lightning Boogie, it's what it's all about. Well, my Mike is one of those sideman guitar heroes that we all know and love, but don't necessarily pay full attention to. You know, somebody like Tom Petty is such a big personality and such a... And again, the thing about Tom was he never shortchanged his band. He never ignored them. He didn't always... He didn't come out with the pretentiousness that some lead singers do. And so... Um, he always took care of his guys. He always did. But 
the charisma and magnetism draws your eyes directly to Tom Petty when you'd see him live. And I mean, that can be said for a lot of other singer songwriters, you know, think about it this way. It's like how many people pay attention to, you know, too many members of the E street band, uh, when Bruce Springsteen's doing his stuff, you know, when Bruce is really on it, you know, he, he, he shares with the band the spotlight, but it's really, you're going there to see Bruce. Well, you were going there to see Tom, but Mike Campbell always somehow or another managed to stand out. Um, sort of like Jackson Brown with David Lindley. Again, another great, great sideman guitar player who deserved the attention. But again, Jackson Brown was such the focal point of the live performance. At least that's my opinion on things. I'll tell you what's really distracting the hell out of me right now is that guitar. <laughs> it, it's it's a personal thing here. A Firebird 5 is one of my absolute bucket list instruments. It's, it's l actually number one on my bucket list all time. I've always wanted a Firebird 5. And the one in that image is so effing sexy, and it's it's driving me crazy. So I'm going to cut this really short because all I can actually think about is that guitar, and I'm not really going to talk about anything else about it if I don't, if I don't shut up now. So uh, with that said, happy birthday to the great Mike Campbell. I hope you all enjoyed this. Please feel free to leave a comment in the comment section. As always, we can talk about it. Just know that I truly appreciate you all, and I wish you well. Take care. Damn, that's a beautiful guitar.